Hello and welcome back to Simpsons Hit and Run, episode four. Uh, last time we started out Bart's storyline and uh, decided to team up with Professor Frank in order to power up uh, this monster thing for him, for violence purposes. Uh, and in this episode, we're going to be headed toward to the Krusty Burger bur to the Krusty Burger in order to find a satellite dish. Uh, but not before we destroy some hornets in the process. Eat my dust, dust eaters. Uh, so let's head to good old Crustal Burger. Excuse me. Uh, hmm, okay. Any, any, uh, anything we need to do around here? There's some races. Uh, I'll do this mission, and then we'll start doing races. <laughs> I didn't do it. Wazzle Woozle? Satellite dish? Sure, if you help me scoop up my flat meat, sophisticated city youngster. Those darn revenuers don't like me selling roadkill. Collect the flat meat before time, so time runs out. Avoid a no poop. Alright. It's time for some road rage. Bart Simpson style. Uh, okay. Move it, land cow. Yeah, land cow. As opposed to an ocean cow, which I suppose would be a whale. Uh, <laughs> if, uh, if, uh, if you know, you know. And by if you know, I mean the evolution of whales. Uh, if you know the evolution of whales, then you definitely do know the evolution of whales. Oh my god, did we just hit Lenny? Not Lenny! Okay. Man, you're, not, you're really not given. Yeah, uh-huh, some of these, yeah, some, oh shit, some some of the time limits in the later mission can uh, get really tight, actually. Like, uh, I don't know, maybe, maybe I was, maybe I just sucked at video games as a kid, but I remember this game being really fucking hard. No, I deliver the flat meat to Krusty Burger. Were, weren't we supposed to avoid off or something? Maybe, uh, maybe he's gonna show up. <laughs> uh, huh. Right. Yeah! Bitch! Fuck you! Oh, let's go through the car wash. Whee! This is how speedrunners go through car washes. Oh, the the, uh, the fucking GPS doesn't tell you to go through. It'll route you around the broken roads. I didn't know that. Uh, to save some time. Oh, I hope I'm able to get there in time. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'll be able to get there in time. Well, I'm gonna get the Krusty Burger and purchase fast food to pass it off as our own cooking. Uh-oh. 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 Yeah, that's, uh, oh boy, okay. Shit, we got coppers. We got coppers! Okay. Yeah, sure, whatever you say, buddy. Oh, come on, we gotta take that big jump. No, wait, shit, this is the stadium. I thought we were about to take that big jump next to the abandoned building. Oh, shit, fuck. Oh, shit, fuck. Oh, shit, fuck. Okay, the police are finally leaving me alone. And we just gotta get off poo to leave us alone. You fucking fuck. Fuck you, Bart, now's not the time for jokes! Come on, come on, go, 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 go,
Yeah, you see what I meant? Like how? Uh, I get rid of this fucker. Okay. Uh. Huh. Okay. Okay. I guess we gotta just do this again. Near. Beep beep. I click this as a funny honk. See, we can just. Uh, nice. The tea factory. I'm just gonna spill the tea. Oh, man. I broke my yeah, sure, whatever you say, please, buddy. Time to lay some rubber down. Uh. Watch the dang road. What do you mean get back in the car? I'll get back in the car whenever I damn well please. Jump to light speed. This is fucking my this is this is my car. I'll I, I will use it or not use it as much as I damn well actually it's place car. But you but you get the point. Oh boy. Uh I might actually not make it. Oh boy. No, there it is, there it is. We're fine, we're fine. Okay, cool yeah. Just gotta head back to Corpy Burger. Sick drips. Fuck me. Uh, boy. Now nah, we're good. We're good. Cool. Yeah. Uh, I think I think last time the car wash fucked us a little bit. No, it definitely didn't. Uh, not taking the shortcut definitely Whoa, fucked us, though. Wicked. So, we'll be taking the shortcut. Uh, because, you know, we, uh, we learn from our mistakes on this channel. Uh, unlike some people, some people never learn from their mistakes. Uh, the nerve of some people. Uh, even with the shortcut, now we're fine. Now we got to deliver the delicious goods to the fire. I sure hope they like steak dogs, cause I do. Please stop what you are doing. No one can sell rotten meat in this town but me. Okay. Get away from this fuckhead. Too easy. Come on. There we go. Too easy, baby. All right, now we just got to deliver this shit to Corpy Burger. I believe that's what it's called. Crusty burgers are made of roadkill? That explains the tire tracks. Take this satellite dish as a reward. She gets 14 channels, including the outhouse channel. Man, I love watching that. Thanks, inbred hillbilly. Torrent nothing. Oh, oh. There we go. My camera's, uh... And the crowd goes wild. Camera's going a bit odd there. Uh, anyway. Well, there's a race over here. Let's do that. Let's do that before we do anything else. Oh, it's Nelson again. <laughs> Nelson, huh? Why are you hanging around here? Stupid community service. I did Martin in the Salsa Quickie Mart. Anyway, get your license and you get some stupid prize from those jerks. Complete all laps and finish the race in first place. Don't destroy your vehicle. Okay, well. Three, psych, two, psych, one, go! Is that, is that Lisa? Is that Lisa up there? I think that is Lisa up there. Oh my god, Lisa's a menace. Oh boy. Lisa, Lisa's using her giant giga brain to fuck up my frame rate. Well, we'll see about that. Yeah, Lisa is a cheater. All right, Lisa, that's it. She thinks I won't, but I will. She thinks I won't, but I will. She thinks I won't, but I will. Give me a sec. Sorry, I had a little spittle on the bottom of my lip and it was really starting to bother me. Uh, fuck you, Lisa. You bitch, you whore. Epic. All right. Oh, now, uh, now we just got to stay Don't ahead of try. her. I, ho I hope that's not as difficult as... I, I hope that's as easy as it sounds. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Okay, we got, okay, we got one more lap. Okay, oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Losing control. Losing control. All right, we're fine. We're fine. We just got a sick drift. 
Epic. Look at how far ahead we are of him. Too easy. That a boy, Bart. You're getting a birthday present this year. Awesome. <laughs> All right. I believe that's the race we just did. Yes, that is the race we just did. Uh, I did see some cards around. I think it was this way. Oh, this yeah, over there cool. by the books. Uh, the book bookstore. Books the bookstore. I think we can hop onto that awning. Yeah, I love this card up there. Whoop. I donh, don't know. I guess we can't. Uh, that's okay. We can use the car as a plow. Oh, no. Oh, no, wait. Let's use the plow truck as a platform. You fucking bitch, Bart. Get out of the car. Jeez. All right. This game's really starting to test my patience. Yes. More like 10-year-old hitchhiker needs a platform to jump on. What? What the hell are you doing? Alright. Nice. What is this? AM Radio Toy! Yeah, from, uh... uh I forget what the episode was called, but it was that episode where he, like, falls, uh, he pranks the town by making them think there's someone stuck in the well. And he falls into the well, and it's like irony or something. Uh, let's not use this shitty car. Let's use the fucking good one. Uh, if I see any more cards or races, I'll stop for them. So I do want to have... Um, Electrar... Electrosius? Whatever the hell this one's called. Yeah! Bart's not asking. He's demanding for a pimped out ride. Respect. Oh, shit. There's Ralphie. Hey, Ralph. Hi, Mr. Lisa. If you win, the man ladies will give you a car. Bring it. You get a car. You get a car. All right. Checkpoint race. Five, 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 four. Oh, thanks, Ralph. Oh, we got to beat Lisa again. Aw, loser. Wait, can we just... Okay. Don't have a cow, man. Yeah, don't have a cow, man. You know, it's, Bart cat... it's Bart's catchphrase. He says that... All the time on the show. He said that he says that all the time. Uh, I cannot remember a single point where Bart says I have a cow, man. I, 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 like, legitimately says that. I, I don't think I've ever heard it where, where, he, where he said it legitimately, and it hasn't been, like, a joke. Maybe, you know, maybe he said it in the Tracy Ullman shorts. I, I, wait, am I going the right way? Oh, yeah, yeah. I haven't watched the Tracy Allman shorts. Maybe it's from that? Yeah, I, totally I don't know. But, like, yeah, I've never heard Bart genuinely say I have a cow man on the show before. Maybe, I don't know. I don't know, maybe maybe it's in the Tracy Allman shorts. Maybe I have to rewatch season one. Not terrible. Ah, uh, thanks. Alright, that was so cool! Alright, let's go to the head, head to the stadium now. Uh, unless we see, uh, some more optional shit. I'm gonna go for that. Fuck you, bitches. Uh, wait, let's see. Oh, shit, side quest! Side quest! I need your car from the war. The war? What, is the Kaiser at it again? I'll teach him. He stole my best girl and my best box of saltwater taffy. Grandpa, you're not making any sense. I'm tired because I let Jasper borrow my blood. I didn't think I'd need it. No. Dial B for blood. Okay, we gotta get Grandpa's blood back. Bart Simpson at your service. I'm assuming we're gonna have to like run from Jasper or something. Finding blood is easy. I'd make a great vampire. Hope this is enough. Yeah. I, I, yeah. I, I guess you would make a great vampire. Just like that one Treehouse of Horror short where he literally became an vampire. Wow, that's crazy. Uh, honestly, I'm not really a fan of Treehouse of Horror. It's like, I don't hate it, but most of the time, eh, I don't know. Some of them are really, really good, and some of them are just kind of really lame. Especially in the later seasons, they just get so lame. 
Like, not funny or scary, just straight up lame. The shinning's pretty funny. That's like, the, the, I think the entirety of the shinning is like the funniest thing ever. But, uh, other than that. Mo, do you have any human blood? Nah, what about goat blood? Sure, why not? Collect the bag of blood. Thanks, Mo. He's, uh, you know, giving out blood packs of goat blood. Uh, very kind. Uh, okay. Yeah, so yeah, not really a fan of Trios before. Uh, some, yeah, some of them I like, some of them I really hate. Squeaky voice team. Bart. Fuck you, Bart! Did you have any blood? Would you like fries with that? Easy peasy. Time to kinda blood. getting a lot of blood here. Okay, we just gotta take it back to Jeepa. So I tied an onion to my belt, which was the style at the time. I can't do a good grandpa impression. So I tied <clears throat> So I tied an onion to my belt, which was the style at the time. No, nah, I can't I uh, not too good at doing old man voices. I just get really confused as in how am I supposed to shape my voice. Or maybe it's because I've been recording for like an hour and a half straight. And uh, my voice is really starting, my, my, my throat's starting to hurt. Uh, but you know, maybe it's not that. You know, I, you know, I might need a water break, but I don't have any of my water bottles near me. They're like all over, the, over there. Ugh, whatever. I'll just go go to lunch and then have a drink there. Nice and warm, just how I like it. Is that enough? I need another car. Take it. Oh, I'm going to pour this on my flapjack. I am the king. Congratulations, you unlocked Grandpa's World War II vehicle. Uh, nice. Wouldn't be too much trouble. I really need a new car. This better not turn out to be another one of those man-seeking man calls. Okay, uh, we're gonna act like he didn't say that. Oh wait. Ooh. You go in the DMV. What's going on there? Can, can we buy outfits? I want outfits. I don't remember the episode where that happened. But it probably did. Oh, we can. Now I'm blind. Cool. <clears throat> hey guys, how you doing? Hey buddy, how's it hanging? Tough luck, folks. I don't feel like moving the line today. What's up, Selma? Uh, you can't talk to Selma. You only talk to Patty. Hey dude, what's up? If you're not MacGyver, keep moving. That's so weird, cause I that's is like like the MacGyver Patty thing is kind of weird, cause they've they've clearly stated that. Uh, Patty is gay. Well, uh, I don't know. Maybe she's bi. But but she also has this weird, like, MacGyver thing. I don't know. Well, well, you know, she did... I don't know. Have they ever outright said that she's a lesbian on the show? I don't know. She's definitely attracted to women. She almost married someone. But it turns out they were... They, they were lying about being a woman so they could play in women's sports and be better than everyone, I guess. Uh, we're just going to buy all the costumes right now. Tall. Oh, right. The tall. When he try to make himself tall. Uh, we'll, we'll put on the football outfit. For when he tried playing football. So, yeah, I have no idea what sexuality Patty is, but... Ah, uh, whatever. Doesn't really matter. Uh, she's happy. I think. I don't know. Just soak in an ointment! Is she happy? Is Patty happy? I, I, I honestly have no idea. I, 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 she's just so cynical and she has like no, like spotlight episodes. It's so rare that she gets a spotlight episode that it's like, I, it's like, I really don't know anything about her. Like, uh, like I know a lot about Selma cause Selma has like a lot of those, uh, has a bunch of spotlights. Uh, let me just kill this bee real quick. So, so we know like 
you know, what she, you know, her goals, her, her dreams, like what she wants. And, you know, she wants a family. And she wants a kid. And stuff like that. Uh, and so, so that's why I like uh, Selma more than Patty. Cause, cause it's, it's just because you really don't know anything about Patty. Like, I'm in season 20, and I still barely know anything about Patty other than she's uh, same-sex attracted. Uh, she She's at least to some Why level. Mr. So Honey Bunny. I don't remember where that's from. And, you know, that's neat and everything, but... Uh, I would like to know a little more. Like, like what does Patty want out of life? I I have no idea. Sometimes, because it's sometimes it's portrayed that she's content, so tired. uh, just so with having tired. Selma in her life, and you know other times she's like dating around and stuff. It's a bit odd, I suppose. Well, you know it's not odd. I just I don't know. I don't know. I would just like a clearer picture of of, of who Patty is. Give her something, give her something else to do. Fuck you, idiot. Yay! Money. Oh, damn that. Fuck! I was mashing A! Ah, oh, you know, I'm cutting. Uh, yeah, see what I mean about, uh, the platforming in this game being less than ideal? Uh, yeah. I believe I've, I've demonstrated that. Uh, are there any more cards right in here? Well, come on, Bart. I'll never lose these love hands. Uh, I'm guessing not. Can't go up here, no. All right, uh, let's head to, where are we going? We're going to the stadium. We gotta go back to Frankie Dink. Wrong side, idiot. All right, all right. All right, jeez, all right. Ooh, ooh, there's another card. Stupid Kaiser. Would somebody tell me what just happened? I love Grandpa. He's pretty great. Ah, uh, there's there was uh, uh, actually you know there was a weird fucking in one of the episodes you know since we're talking about Grandpa and the the Bouvier twins. Uh, come on, get up there, Bart. There was a really weird fucking uh, episode where Selma like married Grandpa. And you know, and you know, it wouldn't be that notable. <laughs> Big Butt Skinner from Bart's comic classic. You know, it really wouldn't be that weird. But um, they they did a previous episode where Grandpa was dating um, Marge's mom. Uh, fucking what's her name? What's what's fucking Marge's mom's name? It's like. Ugh, I forget her name. And, and you know, all that's also Patty's mom. So, Grandpa's dated both Selma right, and her mom. And it's like, that's weird, right? That's like, that's like a weird thing to do? Am I correct in saying that? Is, 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 is it wrong to say that? That's like, that's like a little weird? That's something I, that's like... Oh man, that must be a weird family reunion. Uh, I, I mean, they did get divorced at the end of the episode, but you know, still. It's still weird. Anyway. You expect me to complete a Mark 10 Truckosaurus without a blender? Why don't I just make a Plasmoclave without a tennis racket for playing out loud? Now fetch me a blender with the puree and the frappe and the liquefy. Now where am I gonna get a blender? <gasps> Dr. Nick! He loves blended girl drinks during surgery. Hi, Dr. Nick. Didn't a blooming car already? For years, this was the only way to get juice from an orange. <gasps> you mean there's a better way? <laughs> hey. uh, I wonder if Dr. Nick owns a juice loosener. You got all that from one bag of oranges? Bobby? You seem like a heavy drinker. Do you have a blender? Not now, okay? My monkeys have escaped. 
Can you catch them for me? I'll be so grateful. Why won't they come back to you? Because I have tortured them horribly, silly. There's no way I'll be able to fit all those monkeys in my car. I better get a big truck or something. To, uh, to complete this mission, you must... Okay, I already bought Mr. Plow. Uh, thankfully, I was a smart guy and uh, bought... The... Where's this phone booth? There's a phone booth on the... Oh, there it is. Uh, Mr. Plow. Go. Monkey see, monkey do oh! Collect the monkeys second. before time runs out, then get the blender from Dr. Nick. Okay, cool. Yeah. Monkey time! Oh shit. Uh, there's a lot of these things. Are they in straight jackets? Alright, uh, I guess I gotta like get out of the car and run around. Oh no, they just have long arms. I suppose that makes sense for monkeys. Ba -ba -ba -da -ba -da. I love the song. Da -da 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 -da. I think Danny Elfman actually did the music for this game. I think so. Yeah, um, he also composed the intro of the show. I don't think he scored the show, though. That was... Someone else did that. I think. Uh, I don't know. Um, I just know he, I, I I just know he uh, Dan, Danny Elfman's credited as the intro um, composer, which you know if he was just the composer, I don't know why they wouldn't just say it. I don't know. Uh, maybe I'll maybe I'll put some up uh, on on screen if, uh, if Mr. Elfman composed uh, for the show. Uh, so yeah, now that now that you know your answer, um, I guess I have to think of something else to talk about. Uh, I don't really remember any episode where Dr. Nick had monkeys. And I don't know why they're in, they're like, wearing jackets? What? Uh, but Dr. Nick's, Nick's pretty great. If I had to say something about Dr. Nick, it would be, uh, You've tried the best, now go with the rest! It's pretty great. Oh, oh, it's Hans Molman, poor guy. Uh, but hey, who knows, maybe maybe you can make the sequel to Man Getting Hit by Football with that story about getting hit by a car. Hans Molman presents Man Getting Hit by Football. <laughs> Classic. Barney's movie had heart, but football and groin had football and groin. <laughs> it works on so many levels. Uh, if you didn't know, Hans Molman is a renowned filmmaker for his film, Man Getting Hit by Football, in which uh, Hans Molman takes a football in the groin. Uh, which honestly is one of the least, is one of the lesser, uh, torturous moments Hans Molman has Let's had to roll. go through on this show. Dust, dust I would like $17 for a push broom rebristling. And then, uh, Mr. Burns, uh, does some. <laughs> he does some. I don't want to spoil it. Uh, but it's pretty funny. Okay, I got a minute to get nine monkeys. How are you looking at? Uh, monkey, monkey, monkey. Down so Fuck you. Fuck you, Bart. I'm in perfect shape. Oh, shit. Oh, God. I'm focusing too much on money. The greed, the greed, the greed. Oh, good lord. I Okay, I need to get back in my car. Oh, no. Where is it? Where's my car, dude? Oh, there it is. All right, all right, all right, all right. It's still possible, it's still possible, it's still possible. I've been recording for nearly half an hour? Oh my god. I'm, I'm gonna have to push the fucking retry if I don't make it to the next episode. Oh, good lord. Come on! Yes! No, there's no fucking way. Damn. All right, well, join us next time uh, for when uh, we'll try and uh, get these monkeys for Dr. Nick. 
Uh, yeah, episode, uh, join us next time, a Simpsons Hit and Run episode 5. Uh, I will see you all then. Bye-bye.